In the following video, we are going to apply our definition of polynomials to determine if the given expressions are in fact polynomials, and if they are, which type are they? Binomials, trinomials, or monomials? So if we take a look, we have 2x plus 3. First thing I'm going to see is I do have my variable. It has a positive exponent of 1, and there's two terms. So this is a polynomial. And since there's two terms, it's considered a binomial. If I go to number two, 5xy minus 6x squared plus 17y to the fifth, we want to determine if this is a polynomial. And I got my variables x and y, x squared, the y to the fifth. I see three terms. So this is a polynomial. And since it's three terms, we consider it, we name it as a trinomial. But let's look at number three, 4 over x plus y. Our variable is in the denominator. And when we defined a polynomial, we said the variable cannot be in the denominator. You cannot be performing division with the variable underneath the fraction. So this is not a polynomial. And the reason why this is not a polynomial, you can take a look, is we define a polynomial as having variables with you know, positive exponents. And remember, what 4 over x means is your x is being, really being raised to the negative 1 power. That's what brings it down to underneath the fraction bar. And so since it's being raised to the negative 1 power, it's not a polynomial because your exponent is really negative. And so we have square root of x plus 3xy minus 6x for the next example. And since I'm taking the square root of it, that ruins the idea of it being a polynomial. It's not a polynomial. And so this assists us with developing an understanding of what is a polynomial, what are the properties of polynomial, and what are the types of a polynomial for it. 